Okay, so we're going to start with the lower body. There's four major moves we're going to touch on. The first one is the uh, wide squat. Uh, uh, the second one is a narrow squat. We're going to move into a lunge and finish with a deadlift. Sandy, if we start with a relatively wide foot position, so hip width or slightly wider than the hips, if we look at the toes are five past one, it just causes some opening in the hips and activates the bum. So if we focus, Sandy, on the bum moving out the back, use your hands as a counterbalance, your knees remain in line with your toes, that's it. So travel down and straight back up, as though you're going to sit back into a chair. Perfect. We're just going to switch now into a, a, a narrow squat. If we just draw them in, Sandy, your toes are, are pretty much straightforward. Hips, knees, feet in line. Again, the hands as a counterbalance. Bum travels out the back. Straight up, straight down. 10 to 15. Looks good. Take a long stride. The torso basically just lurches straight down and straight up. We want to initiate with some bend in that back knee. So make sure we really come up on that back toe, Sandy. That's it, that's it. Straight down. The stomach is braced to have to work hard. We also hinge at the hips or the glutes, the hamstrings. Everything is working really hard and that's why it's such an effective exercise. See, okay, if we switch sides, if we initiate, bend in this back knee, up on the toe, straight up, straight down. Perfect. Okay, the last move for legs, uh, we're going to look at a deadlift or a stiff leg deadlift. Uh, a quite a good guide for the form is to actually hold some weight. It can be as light or as heavy, you know, depending on your experience or strength. If the head and is, is just an, and the neck is just an extension of the spine, what we want is to allow uh, movement through the hips, the bum travels out the back, but the back stays perfectly flat, and the back stays flat because of the activity at the hips. So really let your bum travel out the back. We're not focused like a squat where the knees bend a lot. Okay, so we're neutral in the feet. Feet, knees, hips. Okay, let your bum travel out the back. Relax those arms. Nice neutral back, perfect. Lever back up, all the way up to the top. Perfect. So that was the last exercise for the lower body. Uh, stay with us if you're gonna run through it again, or just skip to the next section uh, if you wanna move on to the upper body.